Finding a cure, cure for ALS just got a big funding boost from the Minnesota legislature. A bill to pay for research and caregivers is on its way to Governor Tim Walz for him to sign into law. As Caroline Cummings reports, those millions of dollars make Minnesota a national leader. And this is a game changer for the ALS community, and it is a huge boom for the state. Jennifer Jelly can't hide her excitement about a cause she cares about reaching the halls of the Capitol. This isn't anything about party lines. This is about people and helping people with a really difficult disease. Lawmakers pushed party aside and with overwhelming bipartisan support approved $20 million for ALS research and $5 million for caregiver support, which is telling of Senator David Tomasoni's impact on his colleagues. I can't think of a greater champion than him. Tomasoni was diagnosed last summer and has been fighting ever since against the disease and for funding. Those millions will stay in Minnesota, grants to support research that institutions like the University of Minnesota and Mayo Clinic are already doing. This influx of cash will allow them to progress even further. It will also allow people living with ALS in Minnesota to be more active in clinical trials. Mark Bierman has been living with ALS for 14 years. He's been a part of a clinical trial for treatment in California and can't wait for opportunities to expand here. The fact that it's coming from Minnesota and it's research dollars that are going to stay in Minnesota is incredible. What did it mean to you when you found out that the, the legislature passed this bill and it's on its way to the governor? It meant that People are finally listening. They get the message and they understand. It also provided a lot of hope. Caroline Cummings, WCCO 4 News. The local chapter of the ALS Association says this is the largest investment any state has ever made.